Hi guys, this is Arvind, came here with PV Sindhu Life Story. Usually, all Indians like to watch cricket match, whether India will win World Cup or not. And all will sit in front of TV and they will pray that India should win. But it was the first time they are all praying for a badminton match and all Indians are waiting. Yes, that is August 20, 2016 Olympic game was held in Brazil. It was the first Indian woman to qualify final. Whole India was waiting for the match. All Indians were concentrated on TV by watching badminton match. The one person who turned all Indian to see badminton match is none other than PV Sindhu. One side was growing Indian player PV Sindhu. Another side was world champion Spain player Caroline. Two fought each other to taste the victory but everyone is thinking that Sindhu will win gold but it was a disappointment to everyone because she won silver medal the first time in Olympics the first Indian woman to get silver medal in badminton but everyone is celebrated and she got wishes from citizen of India to president of India she get trained by wishes and fame she got a nickname from fan that is Silver Girl of India and they trended one tweet. Sindhu lost the gold but she owns the million of heart. That time her age was 21. Then all started to search about PV Sindhu in Google. Poo Sarala Venkata Sindhu was born in July 5, 1995 in Hyderabad and her father name is PV Ramana and mother name is P Vijaya. In small age, she has interested in sports. The reason for this is her mom and dad. Both mom and dad was volleyball player. Her dad won Arjuna award for his gameplay but his mom and dad believed she will be a big star in volleyball. But Sindhu took badminton instead of volleyball. The reason behind this badminton player Gopi Chan. While Sindhu was 6 years old, she was watching Gopi Chan match. That time itself she fixed. Then she took as Gopichan as hero and coach in badminton and she started to travel. Her father seen her interest in badminton then he joined in Megaboos Ali coaching. In that whole team Sindhu was too young so that no one is willing to play with her. But her coach seen her interest and he given one idea. That idea was play with the ball. Then he told due to your gameplay and power the wall should break. But we don't know whether she has that much strength but she has that much guts and willpower on her. Then she started to win more matches. Then in school level she got more cups. Then she started to travel with badminton. The turning point on her life is Gopi Chand coaching center. For badminton, he started equipped coaching center, then PV Sindhu joined in that coaching center. In 2009, she stepped in international match. It was the first international match, but she signed with bronze medal. In 2012, China opened badminton match. She participated and her opponent was one who won the Olympic gold medal in London, that is Lee Shrey. Sindhu defeated Lisre and she proved that she will be the future badminton player of India. Then she started to meet losers. 2016 August 19 Olympic final, 2016 November 27 Hong Kong Open badminton match, 2017 August 27 World Championship, 2017 November Hong Kong Open badminton match, December 2017 World Super Series in Dubai. Final, she lost in all matches. Then 2018 February Indian Open match, 2018 April Commonwealth Games, 2018 July Thailand Open Badminton, 2018 August China World Championship, 2018 Asian Games, 2019 July Indonesian Badminton match. But continuously, she lost in all matches. But in between, she tasted small, small victories. But her goal was getting World Championship title. World Championship was held in Switzerland in parcel. In women's singles, she get 5th rank. Then she played with 4th player 
that is chinese player shan yu fei then she was entering third time in career but her aim was getting the gold and indian national anthem should be singed in switzerland but every indian and the badminton player were thinking whether she will win gold or not in 25th august final between nasami and pv sindhu in that match pv sindhu dreams comes true that she won the gold medal and world championship title she was not get the victory simply and she sacrificed many thing and her hard work and dedication was behind her victory to reach gopichand academy she used to travel 60 kilometers daily for his world championship she quitted using mobile phone and obeys her coach words blindly if her coach tell her to play in mud she used to do she will not ask any question to her coach praise like sunlight helps all things to grow self praise is for losers be a winner stand for something always have a class and be humble hard work beats talent when talent does not work hard there is no substitute for hard work if your dreams don't scare you they are not big enough by seeing her victory all parents should allow girls to play badminton because it has a better career and better future so that they can be a next pv sindhu or sania thank you for giving this opportunity dream big work hard stay focused and surround yourself with good people good luck for your olympics and go for and wish you happy birthday to pv sindhu from crazon badminton family